Hey y'all, it's Kent here with a really cool game called Multi. This game is being kickstarted right now, and uh, I had a really fun time playing this game, and so I want you to check it out and see what you think about it. So as you can see, the basis of the game is this big tic-tac-toe board, and you've got these big X's and O's that you use to try to get three in a row, like a normal tic-tac-toe game. But as you can see, we've got these little X's and little O's that you actually use to play many versions of the game. And the way that this game works is if you get three in a row in one of the mini games, then you get to claim that entire game for either X or for O. So how do you claim those? Well, it's actually really interesting. The game board itself is broken into nine sections for the nine tic-tac-toe spots, and each one is one of the multiplication tables. So this is the ones times table from one through nine. This is the twos times table from one through nine. This is the threes times table from one through nine. And it goes on four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So how do you claim these little spaces? Well, let me run you through the first few rounds of this game. So the, the mechanic is very familiar to people who have played the product game before, where you're basically choosing two factors from this list of nine factors, and then you get to claim the product on the board. So let's say that, uh, Circles is going to go first, or O's is going to go first. They choose four and get to pick any product of four on the board. So one times four, two times two, and four times one. Then it's X's turn, and they're going to place another one of these on one of these factors. So let's say they place it on three. Well, now they get to claim any product of four times three, which is 12. So we grab some X's and we go searching for 12s. Well, let's see here. Here's three times four in the threes group and four times three in the fours group. But not only that, they also get to claim any other 12s that are on the board. So two times six and six times two. They also get to claim those. Now it's back to O's turn. Now, O can either move this factor or this factor, but not both. So it can't move to like seven times five. It can't move both of them, but it could move the three to the five and get four times five. Or it could, instead of moving the three, it could move the four to a seven and get three times seven, all the 21s on the board. So um, let's just say it does uh, four times nine and goes out and claims all of the 36s. So let's see, there'd be one in the fours times table, there'd be one in the nines times table, and then of course there's another 36 in the sixes times table. All right, so now it's X's turn. X, uh, let's say, is going to move this to two, so it's gonna claim all the eights on the board, four times two, two times four. Um, let's see, there's an eight, uh, there's an eight, and of course one times eight, and then going down here, eight times one. And now, if you look carefully at the board, you can see over here that the O's have a chance to win an entire game if they can get 20. Well, how do they get 20? If you look carefully, it shows you four times five is 20. So even if your kid doesn't know their multiplication facts by heart, this is a great way for them to practice, to remember them, and to realize that, oh, I've already got a four, so all I need to do is slide this down to the five, and then I come over here and claim this 20, and claim this 20. And now that I have this game, I can move all those off and say, all right, O's gets that mini game in the entire game. And of course you continue playing until somebody gets three games in a row and they win that round of multi. Anyway, this game is awesome. My, my son had a really fun time playing this and has had a lot of really interesting mathematical insights just from looking around at the board and noticing some patterns on it since then. So I'm really happy that I was able to get a copy of this game and I would love if it were available to everyone throughout the country. So hopefully you'll consider supporting it.